And now to Commitment 2017 for a second time. St. Tammany Parish voters turned thumbs down on sales tax renewals to support the parish courthouse and jail. And while the present tax doesn't run out until March of next year, WDSU reporter Heath Allen reports some say cuts and layoffs could be on the horizon. We want to make as few cuts as possible to the services for this parish, but we, we have to cut somewhere. Are you ready to go? Voters in St. Tammany Parish voted down two fifth of a cent sales tax renewals over the weekend, and now parish officials say cuts in services and possible layoffs could be in the offing. The two proposals would have generated about $18 million a year combined. One of the proposals supported the parish courthouse, the other the St. Tammany Parish Jail. Revenue from the previous tax stops next March. Sheriff Randy Smith warned as many as half of his jail staff could be cut if the proposal failed and operations scale back. Brister says budget planning for next year has already started and everything is on the table. We're talking about everything at this point, Heath. Uh, everything's on the table. We will have to find a way to make up $18 million in our budget and that we've already started our budgeting for next year. So it's today we have to start looking at all those things. Where will the money come from and can the parish go back to the voters one more time? Look at that coming up at six o'clock. In Mandible, Heath Allen, WDSU News.